What is the secret to longevity? I'm just 27, so it may sound weird me talk about longevity. But just listen to what I have to say here. There are many people looking for the secret to a long life. Some say you need to eat healthy. Others say you need to sport more. Because if you do, if, you, if you're into sports, you remain fit. All of that has its core of truth. Okay? But what is it that will guarantee a long life? You need to be spiritually covered. And you know of me, I do not support paranormal covers. Absolutely not. However, there are, are elder people out there that are still alive today because they had the paranormal cover. That's why they avoided a lot of arguments and a lot of negative energy during their lifetime. And that's why they're still around. Am I going to praise paranormal charms because of that? No. Because those, those people aren't serving God. You, in Christ, you have the cover. The reason I'm telling you need to be spiritually covered is because that's the only way you can guarantee that your body will be around for a long time. Because when your body expires, you'll be in shoal until Christ resurrects you. Okay? So you as a spirit being, you don't die off. Your body does. However, you need your body to be active in the earth. You want to remain long in this body? That's a good desire. You don't secure it by a good diet, by sporting, and by... Um, being religiously active you need to be covered look you can be someone that eats healthy that sports someone that never bothers other people you can be polite and all of that but one day you may be at the office and a co-worker is about to explode because he doesn't want to face himself and it can be that you are around and suddenly he has his explosion and he throws some object at you and you end up in a hospital and later you die through the internal bleedings what happened here was it your fault that you died early no it's someone else that exploded but just but your your body is still gone okay so how do you anticipate this? You couldn't have known that his colleague was about to explode. Some things you just don't see them coming. What do you do? We you have your spiritual cover. Let's say now you walk by faith and you operate in the power of the Holy Spirit. Suddenly you hear your, your boss tell you that you're fired and you think, what? Why am I fired? But you accept it. You're without, a, without, without work for a while. Then you get another job. And afterwards, you hear that a colleague exploded and harmed several people at your former workplace. What happened? Because you were covered, you escaped that dangerous situation that may have either ended your physical life or may have endangered your physical life. It can be that you're in the ghetto. And you think because you're from the ghetto, anytime anyone can shoot you. But hold on, there's a, you have a grandmother praying for you. And this hinders people on the streets from coming near you. There were guys from the streets that wanted to dump their negativity on you. But you didn't end up in a hospital. Or worse, you know why? Because someone was praying for you and there was a cover around you. That covered you. Look. Pagans know this. Pagans do nothing without their cover. That's why you can see pagans living in ghettos or they live in places where nobody else would want to live and nobody robs them, nobody harms them, nobody comes after them. Not even the toughest criminals. Why? Because they are covered. I'm telling you, you need to be spiritually covered. If you want your health to be guaranteed, you want your youth to be extended, you want to remain long in this body. I support all of those wishes, or I support all of those desires. Those are biblical desires, but you need to be covered. 
without a cover, anything can happen to you anytime. You have many unbelievers out there, atheists, agnostics, people who quote unquote believe in themselves. They're not covered. Anytime, anything can happen to them. That's why it's important to cover your kids also in prayer. Pagans, when they have their children, they make their children wear some amulets or some um, crystals or some necklace. Why? Because those are charmed objects that cover their kid. That's why their children are not kidnapped. That's why their children are often not bullied. That's why their, their children often avoid angry or mistreatment by others. Why? Because they are covered. Now, just because you're covered doesn't mean people can't intend negatively towards you. There will be people that will intend negatively towards you. But when you're covered, it just can't reach you. And if you have the cover from the Holy Spirit, you will face retaliation because you operate in the power of the Holy Spirit, which will overcome. You need a cover. In the world, they distract you with diets, with sports and all of that. And they let you think that's the way. Others tell you, well, just don't mind other people's business. Just do your own thing. Don't bother anyone else. Then you'll be left alone. That's not true. When people explode, they explode. And when cowards want to dump or unload themselves, they want to unload themselves. And they don't care whether you're Christ himself or the Apostle Peter or whether you are a drug addict. When they want to unload themselves, they want to unload themselves. And whoever is accessible for them to dump upon, that's what they will do. You need to be covered. That's it. You need to be covered. Apart from longevity, anything you want to accomplish in life, whether it's having a family or your own business or you want to build an institution for your people, whatever it is, whether it's an individual or a collective purpose, you need to be covered. There are people out there who should have been dead by now. It's because they walk by faith they're still alive. You have pagans out there, they don't follow Christ, they don't have the Holy Spirit, but they're only alive right now because they had the paranormal charm that covered them. Some of them should have been dead a long time ago because they had a lot of, they had a lot of many psych attacks come against them. They had people that wanted to do the two things to them but because they were covered nothing happened i'm telling you you need to be covered i keep repeating it because this needs to get through to you don't be distracted by the bs the world world's gurus will teach you and also not the bs that they tell you in babylon churches you need to be covered so i agree with christ glorify him all your days and be at peace